all my life, even in the military, all my guidance, all my, you know, mentorships that I had in life, it's always been about the five P's. Proper preparation prevents piss poor performance. But according to Cody Sanchez, this is the method that you should take. So check out this video and come back to see our reaction to the video. Mental masturbation, the single biggest reason why most people don't win. You think about your goals, you visualize your goals, you talk about your goals, instead just do the work and ignore the noise. All right, Alex, you heard Cody. You know, Cody is successful in her realm of buying boring businesses and things of that nature. So we're gonna let you start it off. What you think about the video that Cody presented? She's always got a way to articulate her words, as you've said before. She really knows how to just get her point across. And I think I love that about every video, especially this one. It was just short and straight to the point, but like it clicked. You can understand it because at least in my life, I've met a lot of people and I know a lot of people, people especially that are close to me, that they fantasize a lot. They have all these fantasies and they repeat the same stories. They repeat the same imaginations the same visions for their future but they grow older and older and nothing changes and that's what this video reminded me of is those people in my life people that never take action they just always think of something and that thought of it like makes them excited or whatever and but the only thing that they're lacking is just take action. And some of these goals that people have are not, even, I wouldn't even call them goals they're just dreams. And people don't realize that you could just be stuck in your dreams because you have to make your dream a goal, but they get stuck in these dreams. And really it's not even that far fetched for them to reach it. A lot of people that I meet, it's not like they're dreaming of being a trillionaire or you know, the next Fortune 500 company. They're just, maybe they want to buy a house or they have a dream to do their first flip or whatever it could be. And it's just, they're just a couple steps away, but their whole life, they just keep thinking of it and they never jump into it and take action. And that, uh, that definitely goes against what we teach, or at least, especially what you teach, just jump right into it, you know? I mean... People really got to stop fantasizing and understand that if you're just dreaming, it's just a dream until you put it into action, it becomes a goal. Right. And I think that a lot of people, their reason for, as Cody said it, uh, mental masturbation, the reason why they do it is because they want everything to be perfect. But yeah. as you've come to realize, nothing starts off perfect. It's, it's OJT, on-the-job training. You're learning, you're learning as you're going through the process. Yeah, you have a mentor to help you over the big obstacles, but still, no matter what, no matter how much mentorship you get in life, no matter how many videos you watch on YouTube, it's still going to be issues that arise that you're going to have to tackle. Yeah, you can bounce the ideas or the issues off of other people, but you're going to go through it. There is no mentor, there's no, there's no guide that's going to cover every single possible thing that's going to happen. I mean, Alec, we could talk about, uh, you know, you going through the uh, buying rental properties, you buying stocks, you know, you doing your online business, um, you're saving up, you're trading options, you're doing doing a lot of things. It was always something that arose that came up and was like, oh, damn, we ain't talking about this. But we had to figure it out. That's what it is. And this mental masturbation, which she's calls it, which I love, uh, I see it a lot. I see it a lot because, you know, people always call me and bounce ideas. And then my my answer is, all right, all right, well, you got the framework. All right, so get into it. And then you got those people that overanalyze, overanalyze, and then they analyze themselves out of the idea. Then look down the line, somebody else is doing their ideal, and then they're mad at somebody else for doing their idea. But it's because you just sit there and talk to everybody about your ideal and never put action. And then you have those people that, you know, they always come up with a new idea, new game plan, new game plan. And then they don't stay focused on that. And then they pivot and then do something else. But all right, this is my new plan. And then do, do, do. And then this is my new plan. Every time the world turn or as the wind blows, their uh, ideas switch and things like that. And then all this planning, all this writing down, all these ideals, 
all these, uh, I need to create an LLC for this, I need to create an LLC for that. One thing you do is just jump into it. And I remember the conversation when you said you believe in, uh, I believe in just going to it. I was like, just do it. Yeah. And I remember you called, like, what about this? What about this? I was like, just do it. Yeah. You figure no, everything out that. the rest of the way. Yes, yeah, sir. This had been, this is with uh, stocks. I hadn't even gotten into real estate yet. And uh, mm -hmm. it was at, like probably 30 minutes into market open. And you're like, why are you still thinking? You should have done that before the market open. You're like, just action. I'm like, what? Like, so I can't think at all. He's like, just action. Just take action. Like, just just make yeah. the trade. You know, so. Yeah. I mean, you had all day. I mean, like, I mean, not you, but people in general. You have all day. You've been thinking about it for forever. Go ahead and do it. You got the game plan. Just execute it. Will it 100% work correctly? No. Never has. I mean, you can even ask Cody Sanchez. I mean, she probably talks about it. I haven't looked at all her content, but she gets into it and she makes it sound easy now, but she gets into these ventures and it's always something that pop up that she's not prepared for. That is what entrepreneurship is. That's what business is. That's what trying to be better is, is you're going to take your knowledge base, what you came up with, you're going to jump into it. And you're looking and saying, any issue that I arise, that arises, I will find a way to conquer. That's it. That's what I did. When I was coming up, getting in all this debt, I was analysis paralysis, analysis paralysis, you know, because everybody say proper planning prevents piss poor performance. That's what I meant. And I was thinking like, oh, I got to plan to the hilt, plan to the hilt. And then stuff never came to fruition because I thought it had to be perfect. I had to over plan, over plan and make everything perfect. And then when I finally took a half a leap of faith on what I've been uh, analyzing on, I mean, analyzing on, excuse me, analyzing, it's not even a word, but <laughs> analyzing, and it didn't work to perfection, I was ready to quit because it didn't work to perfection. And then once I just started and I just said, forget it, I'm just going to take action, I'm just going to take it how I go, take action, take it how I go, then I start seeing fruits of my labor. And those are the things that people need to, you know, take take account of and realize that sometimes you just got to do it. And it's a lot like we had the video about the richest, the richest ideal is in the graveyard. These are people that never took action on what they needed, what they should have done. They just had a whole bunch of great ideas and they never took action to make them come into fruition. Yeah. And I, I mean, I can't even tell you how many times I have heard people just think, on on just their dreams just what they want to do and just the fantasies that they have but really what i've learned through this is you know it's almost like while you're doing it you don't even have time to fantasize or dream about it you're just doing it you're just in there grinding every day just trying to get it done just you could see the goal ahead but you don't put too much thought on it you're just like i need to get to this let me focus on the steps let me reach that goal and then maybe once you reach the goal you're like wow i actually did it but you're not really you're not thinking that much on oh i want to do this i want to reach that like you're just you're just in there doing the work and so many people it's just the easy way for them it's just oh let me think about it because they don't believe in themselves enough to actually do it they don't want to take the risk and see if they can actually accomplish it and really the most easy way to accomplish that goal which we've mentioned before on this channel is just look at what's in front of you and just take those steps right in front of you stop thinking okay i want to get to way over here in front of me just look at what step you have to take and then the next step and the next one and eventually you will reach those goals but just dreaming on something is never going to get you to where you want to be yeah with all that being said please like share comment in the comment section below uh tell alex he, he's crazy uh you need to plan <laughs> you need to plan for the rest of your life and then don't do nothing but <laughs> i don't think that'll work for you but if that's how you feel please comment below y'all have a good one we'll see you in the next video